We talk frequently about the democratization of ADAS, lowering the cost to the point where every car, every car we build has ADAS capability. This is really the heart of why we're pursuing a radar-centric solution. I think the, the big advantage of the new generation of pedestrian detection algorithm is that it really works in cluttered environments. Machine learning can help to look on millions of samples and find the right compromise and then it can extract complex correlations between inputs and outputs. And this is something no human engineer can do and that's why it excels in a wide range of tasks. If there is something, what is it? Is it uh, something that is overdrivable? Is it not? Is it something that you can somehow uh, go around? Is it something that you simply have to stop? Is it a damage to, to have contact with this object? We have a kind of three times better accuracy, um, which is pretty astonishing because usually you wouldn't, wouldn't think that machine learning improves the physical performance. And also if you use multi bounce effects, um, you can really see that there is objects with high reflectivity on the ground. So you see them twice, basically, for example and that you can use for height estimation, for example, what classical radars has big issues with. So there's a lot of, as I said, noise effects that actually can be turned into benefits. The nice thing uh, about radar is that you can uh, look around the corners and you can also see what happens between cars. So a child between cars that for, for a human driver is invisible, LiDAR and camera always need line of sight. So that means if you have a truck directly ahead of you, you see the truck and nothing else. With radar, you can see under the truck. You can see then even the car in front of the truck. It is available when the driver really needs it. Yeah, so under harsh conditions, when it's raining, when it's snowing in the night. With a radar-centric solution, you get a lower processing requirement. It's data light, but yet very capable. So a radar-centric ADAS system actually gives you both the cost you want but also the performance you need.